Hello guys, I'm gonna show you how to download Forgotten Hope 2. Forgotten Hope 2 is a Battlefield 2 mod, but... Oh, that will no longer be required! Yes, thanks Patrick. Battlefield 2 is no longer required in order to play this game. So, if you have Battlefield 2 already installed in your computer, just go to this website, I will leave the link in the description below. Click on Forgotten Hope to launch your setup and simply download and install your game. If you don't have Battlefield 2 installed, go to this website. I will leave the link in the description below. Click on download tool and here you have uh, different options. You have slim installer and full installer. And below uh, full installer you have uh, different options you have torrents you have Google Drive you have OneDrive etc since I have torrents I'm gonna use use this option and wait for wait for the ISO file to be downloaded once the uh, download is complete you will find the image disk or or ISO file for Forgotten Hope 2 in your hard drive and right click on it open with and click on WinRAR so here you can uh, extract th these file in a specific folder or simply click on Forgotten Hope 2 setup just click on it and wait for installer to be launched and here's the installer choose your uh, language click on ok and browse your file if you want to click on next next all along and install your game now I'm gonna close the installer since I have the game already installed in my computer and I'm gonna show you how to play this game. And here's the launcher, click on play. Now when you successfully open your game, click on manage accounts, click on create accounts, accept terms, and choose your nickname i'm gonna choose blah 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 like this anyway your email address and choose a password for your game not your email password but a password for your in-game account and click on create an account and there you go here's your game now before jumping to the to multiplayer game or single player I recommend going to options and adjust your graphics and once you make sure that everything is okay here you can uh, play single player games with NPCs or play multiplayer games but now uh, there's only 28 people playing this server but in Friday and weekend there are lots of uh, player in the server sometimes it's reach a uh, 100 player in the server so you can now uh, just get into the battlefield and play with different players around the world in different uh, fronts of World War II. So hope this video was useful and hope you will see you guys in this game uh, sometime, why not, and play in Sim Squad. Anyway, that's it for this video. Take care everybody.